Providence Mayor Jorge Alorza is set to deliver his State of the City address in just about an hour from now. And as he prepares to give his speech, Providence teachers are preparing to picket outside City Hall, claiming Mayor Alorza is unwilling to invest in public schools and education itself. Highway to News reporter Sheena Lasciuto is live now at City Hall with more on today's events. Sheena. Mike Shen and the Providence Teachers Union has organized a demonstration here at City Hall hoping to be heard before the mayor makes his big speech tonight. We see a few dozen people downstairs right now with their signs. However, earlier today I sat down with the president of the union who says right now they're in a standstill when it comes to contract negotiations with the mayor's office. She tells us teachers are frustrated because they have come close to coming to an agreement and then were just recently told the proposed deals are now now off the table. Tonight, educators and their supporters hoping to create a sense of urgency, asking the mayor to invest in schools. Many concerns include the conditions of the current buildings in the district. I await the phone call from his chief negotiator saying let's get, let's get back to the table and have a conversation. But my my um, answer machine hasn't been lighting up by any stretch of the imagination. So we'll see. And I reached out to the mayor's office and was sent this statement through email from his press secretary. Quote, we're aware of the informational picket. The administration remains committed to coming to an agreement that best benefits our students, teachers, and school community. The State of the City address is scheduled to start at 6 o'clock tonight. We'll bring you the latest from City Hall later tonight. Reporting live in Providence, I'm Sheena Lushudo, Eyewitness News.